1-800-LAW-1010, 1-800-LAW-1010.com. Paul Harding from Martin Harding Mazzotti. Do I need to become one of them uh, libertarians, Cantera? Well, I don't, I, this is why we have Paul on here. There's this, <laughs> something we read in the paper that this, the DMV, so the state of New York is, is, is not allowing TransUnion, the credit reporting agency, at some traffic information records. Is this, Paul, the state sticking up for its citizens? I, you know, that's a, that is a real good way of looking at it. So oh, they... So it's not. They, here's, no, well, there's well, three it, dozen it, it, other states that are getting they're getting this info out, so it sounds like yeah. it. Yeah. Well, true, yes. Yeah. So when we go to figure out how much insurance companies are going to charge us for our driving privileges to get our insurance, they look at our record, right? They go to the DMV, look at our record. So there is a statute that says that the DM, the insurance companies can get that information, but they hired TransWestern. But TransWestern is really not someone who assesses driver's risk. They just are a credit agency. So it's kind trans of Union, a thing. You mean? Yeah, tra- okay. I'm saying trans yep, TransUnion. And so they've gone ahead and they've said, TransUnion, you can't get this information to give to the insurance companies to decide how much uh Cantera's uh driving, you know, insurance is going to be. Uh we need you to do it another way. So it's sort of a technical a libertarian sticking up for us way, but as soon as they do it the right way, maybe with a different organization, they will give that information. Like, out. like an, if an insurance company went to the DMV for the information, they would be granted the information. So right, right now, yeah. all they have is the convictions, and that's it with no names. Sounds right. to me like they want to poke into our lives and judge us. <laughs> they do. They want to find out how long they're going to charge you more or less than they are me because based on my driving history. What I thought was also interesting as I'm reading this, and, and you can tell me if I read it correctly, Paul, but the state does sell our information. When we sign up for a license, do we allow ourselves to have that information sold? Well, you know, so there is, they actually do, there is a small fee that they do get for providing this information to the agencies, but it's pursuant to statute. Yeah, the law says that, that these insurance companies can access the information, uh, and there is a fee to do that. So you look at it that way. Our information is being, in essence, sold uh, to agencies to decide if we are good or bad drivers. Wow, so much judgment. <laughs> so, much, being judged. so much information out <laughs> no, there. No, I mean, yeah, it's insane. It's insane. And we have to keep track of everybody, and now we have to keep track of everybody and their attitudes. So where is this Where is this now? The DMV is just, the TransUnion is yeah. just fighting with the DMV and it's in court? Yep, they're in court. Trans, you know, this, this uh, TransUnion is going to, Say, listen, we are able to get this information. And interestingly enough, the other states just kind of rolled over. New York state, state said, you don't technically meet our statute. We're not doing it. And they'll probably win. But again, the insurance companies will just find another way to access that information with another group that does more than just assemble. They'll get someone that actually assesses the information and provides the data back to them. And then our information will be flowing out of DMV. <laughs> Wherever it flows, and my insurance will still go up, and nothing will nothing will change. I'll be worse for everything. When we're charging you more because you eat gas station hamburgers, oh yeah, well that's your health insurance going to charge you more for that. (laughs) It doesn't matter. They told everybody. (laughs) Everybody knows. Paul Harding from Martin Harding and Mazzotti, one eight hundred Law ten ten and one eight hundred Law ten ten dot com. Thanks, Paul. Thanks, Paul. Okay, you're welcome. Bye, bye, guys. See you, pal.